welcome back to the doctor usp channel friends and don't forget to click on the like and the subscribe button now how safe do you think your phone is do you think someone sitting 10000 miles away can hack into your phone even without your uh, accepting a call or to click on to any link how does it work let's find out Even the coffee appears tasteless uh, without the smartphone in our hands. But if you think you are safe just by switching off your phone or logging off all the apps, then probably you are not right. We'll soon find out. According to the latest available figures, over 760 million Indians are smartphone users. and on an average they spend 5 hours on the phone daily our dependence on these apps is so much that if some surveillance agency were just to tap into the vulnerabilities of the whatsapp application the amount of data they would get about indians is incredible and this is exactly what has been happening these surveillance agencies are targeting the most popular applications used by people worldwide this news story in the forbidden stories website about the cyber surveillance company nso targeting 180 journalists around the world for surveillance has set off the present debate The investigation into this surveillance was carried out by a group of 80 journalists from 10 countries with technical support from Amnesty International's security lab. At the center of this controversy is the Israeli-based private company NSO. The NSO group uh, denied these uh, claims. suggesting that they were uncorroborated theories and they raised serious doubts about the reliability of uh, the sources of these journalists the consequences of this digital surveillance can be extremely dangerous i have posted links to a recent lecture i had recorded on digital surveillance so you can have a look at that The ways in which your phone can be hacked is simply astounding. For example, by just making a WhatsApp call to you, one which you don't answer, a malicious code can be inserted into your phone. Now there are different ways through which spyware can be installed into your phone through WhatsApp through SMS through iMessages and most importantly through unknown vulnerabilities something which even the phone manufacturers are not aware of and this is the most difficult one You'll be surprised to know the amount of control these hackers can have on your phone even without knowing about it probably they have greater control over the phone than you yourself have let's find out what they can know about us through our phones once the spyware has been inserted they can harvest our whatsapp calls and messages they can harvest our sms's they get to control our i messages our calls emails they can handle our microphone without us knowing it they can use our camera the calendar the photographs the contacts and the gps location digital surveillance is a very new thing 
we are still coming to grips with uh, what are the contours of this surveillance and how to handle this so we have to be aware of this one singular fact just to repeat this spyware like pegasus do not require any interaction from the phone's owner it can be achieved through zero click the spyware take advantage of what is known as zero day vulnerability these are bugs in the phone or uh, the operating system of the phone which the manufacturers are not aware of These bugs can be installed over the phones through wireless trans receivers and also through the photo apps or the music apps on the phone. Over time, many of these phone manufacturers have been able to plug the loopholes in these zero day vulnerabilities. The widespread awareness and the civil society outrage over the digital surveillance is also a good step forward. Thanks for watching friends I will soon be back with another video very soon and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and please send in your comments thank you have a nice day